What's up, guys? It's your boys, and we'll keep back with another scary, terrifying, and creepy vi video from Bizarre Bub. We're about to watch his scary compilation number volume 75 of everything that can be scary inside this video right now. So grab a chair, grab some popcorn as we get ready to see what he's put in here for us to get scared and lose ourselves in terror right here, right now. Let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe right now by hitting that white bar icon down at the bottom right. Smack that bell icon next to it. So when I do post videos like this one, you get that little ring notification that Zwoki myself has posted that video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you guys so very much for the continued love and support that you guys show on this channel every single day. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep doing what you guys are doing, and we'll continue to grow together. Speaking of growth, check out the link in the description for Bizarre Bob himself. Go over there to his channel, watch his old stuff, watch his new stuff. For him to put the, for him to put this together for us to enjoy and get scared and lose ourselves in terror, it can be a lot of work and a lot of effort, and we want to give our thanks back to him. So with that being said, let's get in a video and see why this is the scariest compilation, number volume 75. At approximately 1.30 in the morning, a truck driver was driving down a road that many truckers try avoiding at all costs. Why? According to rumors, the road in question is believed to be cursed, as many drivers have either seen or been involved in an accident while commuting to their destination through this route. Now, it's not just accidents that often occur here, but also unexplainable sightings. Ooh. There have been many reports from drivers who claim to have seen shadowy figures standing on the side of the road as though waiting for someone to pick them up. Shadow men. It's around 1.30 in the morning, somewhere in Louisiana, when a truck driver spots something very peculiar on the road he's on. Knowing the history of this place, he takes out his phone and begins to record. What he captures leaves him totally spooked. Okay. We're driving. Oh, the white figure. Oh, oh. Fine, whipped around really quick. Replay. Like, turns around its head. Look at how fast it does it. And then puts its arm up. Look at its fingers. What the F? Someone, or something, appears to be squatting on the side of the road, doing who knows what, before turning around to look at the driver. It looks creepy. Aside from the fact that it's late at night in the middle of nowhere, the way in which they turn their head and wave at the camera seems quite unnatural. Gross. It's for this reason that some viewers believe that a skinwalker or a cryptid of some sort was caught on camera. Whether a ghost, cryptid, or person, no new information has been brought forth to clarify what exactly was captured. Gross. There's a mall in Peru that is well known for being one of the biggest plazas in the city of Pacolpa. A lot of kids come here as the plaza holds events primarily aimed at children. Even the mascot of this place is designed to appeal to a young audience, which is pretty evident by the numerous what TV ads run by this mall. Ooh. With so many kids running around the place, it's no surprise that accidents often happen here. Uh -oh. But one accident in particular has left many people unsettled. In 2016, a young girl named Valentina Yamalith had been playing around at an instant photo booth where an exposed cable from the machine was touching a metal railing near the kiosk. Valentina grabbed onto the railing and was instantly electrocuted. Unfortunately, due to the high voltage she received, Valentina was pronounced oh deceased gosh. only hours later. Understandably, Valentina's family had mourned and grieved for days on end. Poor Fast forward girl. to a few years later, and Valentina's story is no longer talked about. Or so it seems. As of recent, the same plaza where Valentina had passed away has been experiencing strange activity within its stores. It's late at night, oh after business gosh. hours, when a surveillance camera inside a store captures this. I couldn't even imagine. I'm watching. Whoa! Oh my gosh. I have instant chills. The video shows what looks to be a small child zooming back and forth at a speed beyond human is capacity. It stuck in the As store? if seeing a child alone inside a store that is closed wasn't strange enough, it runs at a supernatural speed. 
Employees so of the mall can't up. help but think that this may have been the ghost of Valentina, given the tragic history of this plaza. That's but so you creepy. be the judge. Was the spirit of Valentina caught on camera, or had something else been captured? You be the judge. Oh my gosh. Number seven. Holy, I got instant chills on that one. It's late at night when the following happens. The person recording is alone at home when all of a sudden something bone chilling is caught on camera. I feel like I've seen a little bit of this before. Now the person in question is known as Caitlin and it was two Hi, years Caitlin. ago that she was involved in a terrible accident. On August 8th of 2020, Caitlin jumped off a rope swing at a very high altitude, oh. causing her to break her neck after landing oh. on a pile of rocks. Oh. This injury was so severe that she had to stay home for more than a few weeks until she recovered. But during her stay at home, Caitlin would encounter something that still haunts her to this day. No one oh. else is home when this is captured. Glad she's still alive. Sound. Sounds like the doors of hell opening up. Hello? Oh my god. Nobody's there, I'll be calling 911. Somebody's in my home! Girl, you better get on the phone. Be like, yes, operator, help! Yeah, I would not be playing games, dude. Hell no. Girl, I'll be jumping out that window. I, she is too, oh. Oh, they're both opening up. They're both opening at the same flipping time. Uh, oh. Somehow, the two doors open on their own, seemingly at the same time. Oh my gosh. Feeling beyond spooked, Caitlin sits on her bed, paralyzed with fear. Soon after, the video comes to an end. But this wouldn't be the last of it, oh as gosh. only a few days later, this happens. I'm so good, puppy. Is she home alone again? What is that? What does she got? She got a baton? Oh, it's a golf club. <gasps> Bro, I would be... Is that a person? What is that in there? Is that a closet or a bathroom? <laughs> Mother Just like before, fudger. the same door closes on its own, leading viewers to believe that the room itself is haunted. Since oh. then, Caitlin hasn't talked about this or the previous incident. Given how frightened she seemed in both encounters, it might be best to forget about them. How? After all, this terrifying encounter still haunts her to this day. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'd be haunted for life. Number six. In this short video, a famous musician from Argentina had posted something pretty spooky that occurred at a friend's house. Jimena Baron was visiting a very close friend who she's known for over five years. Never has she ever encountered anything like this while being at her place. According to her, she was sitting outside in the backyard when suddenly she felt as though someone had grabbed her shoulder. She immediately gets up and turns around to see who it is. Nobody. But strangely, no one is there. Nobody. Now, although this incident doesn't seem that strange, it's the video itself that's by far the strangest. Okay. It wasn't until looking at the footage captured by the security camera outside that Jimena was- Who attaches a camera to their tree like this? ...left extremely terrified. Anybody? If you zoom in on the video, you can see what appears to be a set of fingers touching Jimena's shoulder. I it's didn't hard to see make it. out at first, but if you pause the video at the right time, 
you can see what looks like a row of distorted fingers. Oh, you see it right now, there. Now, what makes this even creepier right. is that Jimena stands up soon after the hand appears. Because of this, viewers believe that something had actually touched her. But, as always, what are your thoughts on this? It's peculiar. Ghost or something else? Hmm. You let me know. Yes, please let me know. Number five. The following video comes from a man named Bobby who Hi, lives Bobby. with his daughter inside a house where unusual activity has been happening recently. Bobby can't shake the feeling that something is haunting both him and his daughter. Uh -oh. He's been documenting oh, these strange occurrences ever since they started, but out of all occurrences, the following has left him the most unsettled. Okay. Bobby's in his living room when out of nowhere, strange noises come from his bedroom. He grabs his phone and records the following. Smart idea, good dude. Smart idea. It's either in my room or Sky's room, but Sky's passed out right now. But it's crazy. Yeah. Hold on. So Is it just the two of them? See, I'm telling you, I keep hearing weird shit. I think it's coming from my like, room. It sounds like it's messing with like a, a drawer that has silverware in it. Records are kinda cool. Why do you have a thing of full of dolls, man? Look at this. He literally has a doll down here that looks like a sarcophagus from ancient Egypt. This thing is just oozing of... Oh, what the f*** was that, man? Yo. Yo, f*** this. F*** this. Bro is just asking for it. The sound of footsteps is heard right behind him, as though mm -hmm. someone had walked into the room. Spooked out by the noise, he proceeds to close the cabinet and walk out. For the next few months, Bobby would continue to post videos of strange happenings in his home, yep, I remember these. but it's the most recent video that has left him the most concerned. Ooh, okay. He's alone at home when this is captured. Okay. I know y'all hear the footsteps. Yep, it sounds I'm like chasing already. <laughs> So early in the morning, too. You got that Raggedy Ann doll right See, next I to him. See, I you hear him pacing in there. It sounds like somebody's got boots on. Get out of here, man. Hello? Did I hear kids laughing? <sighs> I'm like freaking out. It's still moving around. Mysteriously, the same room where the footsteps were heard opens up on its own. Like before, Bobby was spooked out of his mind, but it seems not as much as when the following incident had occurred. Bobby is once again alone at home when something unexplainable happens inside his daughter's room. This is what he captured. Okay. It always gets crazy when I'm here by myself. Because you're probably my sleeping. Because you're probably vulnerable. What? See? I told you. Who was that? I want our piano again. <coughs> Hello? See, there's her piano. Don't mind her room. She has so many damn toys. I gotta clean up like every day in here. Hello?
But at least y'all caught that part. <laughs> Yo. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Nope. I'm good. Nope. Oh my gosh. Nope. I I'm couldn't good. do that. If I was at home, I'd be going to my, Shut that. my parents' house or something. I'm telling Hell you, no. every time I'm here by myself, man. <sighs> See, look, still going off. still going off in there, man. The toys inside his daughter's room mysteriously start going off by themselves. Now, not much else is known about Bobby's situation, but he continues to post these strange happenings on his channel. He hopes that someone will explain what's happening, as the activity in his house seems to be getting stranger and stranger. I need to get some uh, Ghostbusters in there. Just saying. Ugh. Number four. Now, the exact source of the following clip is unknown. It was reposted by someone who found the video somewhere. Even without a source, though, the footage is still terrifying on its own. It starts off with a group of men who are looking down a manhole. They swear that they either saw someone or something inside it. The man recording takes a closer look and sees this. Is this the one where you see the face come out? I think this is the face one. I think this one's fake. I don't know. Uh, Without I, oh warning, no. the head of someone or something pops into view there's, under the open no manhole. Room in there. Its sudden appearance was enough Whoa. to send a man running away. Like something straight out of a horror movie, the face seemingly disappears as a man steps back. Whatever this was remains a total mystery. I don't know. But real man. or not, the unexpected appearance of this ghoulish it face was. is the stuff of nightmares. It gets the goose for me. Oh my gosh. If you caught something creepy on camera, or if there's any ghost videos you'd like me to check out Silly. and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. That being said, let's get, let's get back, back to the video. The videos. Let's get back into it. Huh? This next video was taken inside a mansion wow, that is well known for being extremely haunted. Elegant. On July 30th of 2022, Sabrina and her husband Carl. Is it just me or is that wall, this door right here? Just saying. Extremely haunted. Look at this door. On July 30th. Doesn't that look like a Hershey's bar? Of... <laughs> I don't know if it's because I'm hungry or want some chocolate, but that looks like a Hershey's bar. <laughs> in 2022, Sabrina and her husband Carl decide to take a tour of the Aston Hall Mansion located in Birmingham, England. Oh. The place itself isn't just known for being haunted, but also for its immaculate architecture wow. that many are taken aback when I seeing feel it like in person. Sam and Kobe have been here. But it seems that the real reason people come here isn't just to admire the beauty of this place, but to experience the hauntings that tourists have encountered. There's a room in this mansion that once belonged to a young woman named Mary no, Holt. Haven't. The story goes that Mary's father had heard that she planned to run away and marry one of the servants who worked there. Upset that his daughter would do such a thing, he goes to her room and locks her inside. Years would pass, and Mary would still be locked up inside this room. It was after 16 years of being grounded that Mary passed away. It is said that she died of starvation, but also partly of a broken heart. Now the story itself is quite tragic, but it seems that it wasn't tragic enough for Sabrina's husband, as according to her, he thought it would be funny to call out Mary after learning about her story. Oh no. This is something Sabrina regrets, as she says that if it wasn't for her spouse calling out Mary, this chilling encounter wouldn't have happened. Mm. The two are climbing up the stairs to Mary's Probably not room as bad. when this is captured. I think we've seen this before on a couple of them. Mary. It's always that room, and then he sees like. <laughs> I mean, you know how? Huh? It's like, goes by fast. We know you're in there. Yeah, this guy's, you? Just, this guy's just asking for it. Where are you, Mary? And this room is like tiny, man. Mary? Mary? There is something in that room. But yeah, there's like no room in there whatsoever. Mary. Are you still in there, Mary? You can come out now. Hello? In 
inside Mary's old room. A shadow-like figure darts across the chamber in a swift motion. The two stand in silence while breathing heavily in anticipation. It doesn't show itself again until moments later after being called out by Sabrina's husband, as though acknowledging the husband's summoning. They're just regretting it. Now something worth mentioning is that the couple doesn't enter the room to see what's inside. The reason for not doing so, They're according to them, to. is that the museum prohibits anyone from entering the room. As with any historical piece on display, this one is off limits to the public. To this day, Sabrina and her husband have no idea as to who, or even what, was caught on camera. What do you think I think? Ghost or fake? A family who lives in England oh, has been gosh, capturing video that? evidence of strange happenings inside their home. Huh? Ever since 1997, the family has been seeing things that they can't seem to explain. More often than not, they would hear strange noises coming out of nowhere well, and even TikTok see guys. things move on their own. To the family, it seems that with every unusual occurrence that happens, the activity intensifies. Now, although they live in a constant state of fear, they still try their best to live comfortably in their own home. On one occasion, the family makes time to chat with one another and a friend of theirs who is visiting them. The father records the occasion on his phone, as moments like this rarely happen. All is going well, when suddenly, this happens. Uh oh, okay. He always pushes it through when I'm sitting on the sofa. <laughs> it's so annoying. Why are you moving? Closer and closer towards me, and almost in my lap, never. <laughs> oh, so why are you still in your coat? <laughs> She's ready to run. <laughs> Don't you trust over there anymore, never? No, I'm all good, thanks. <laughs> why are you moved out in the first place? <laughs> One of the reasons, yeah. Oh, God. I used to talk in the oven. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. It sounds like it's upstairs. Yeah, she's like, yeah. It always happens on Cuba, yeah. yeah. I just don't even like it. Oh my god. Oh, there you go. There's nothing there. This man sends the women. Oh god. As if things inside their home have finally settled, this happens. The sound of heavy footsteps walking about is heard above them. Seeming slightly unfazed, as they've seen stranger things before, they laugh about it and proceed to check on the source. But after standing momentarily at the base of the stairs, an unseen presence runs down at full speed. Uh. This may just be the scariest encounter they've ever had. But until more videos are posted, it seems that this one will stand out from any other creepy occurrence they experience. I heard they're going strictly to TikTok. I don't know. Whew. When it comes to videos of baby monitors that capture something paranormal on camera, got some they usually eyes, tend man. to be creepy. But this next video may just be a lot more wholesome than scary. Whitney Allen is the mother of two children whose father tragically passed away oh. in 2022 after suffering a brain injury caused by a bee sting. Oh, Apparently, Germany. Whitney's husband was severely allergic to bees. Oh. The bee sting he received was enough to send his body into cardiac arrest and affect his brain. Oh my gosh. After months of being in hospice care, he sadly passed away. To Whitney, the passing of her husband was extremely agonizing. But for him to pass away only three months later after the birth of their second child was painfully devastating. The fact that he wasn't able to stay for long to see their child grow up was unbearable to think about. Now even though she feels that her husband wasn't able to meet their baby in a meaningful way on earth, she believes that he was able to do so from the beyond. Late one Little evening, bee. Whitney is looking over at the baby monitor when she sees a mysterious light on her child's head. At first, she thought this light was just a reflection on the screen, but when her child changed position on the bed, the light was still there. She couldn't help but think that this orb was actually her husband, as it seemed to be patting and stroking the baby's head. Aww. Yeah, it's not as scary when it's a lot more wholesome. Just like sitting there. Goes up and it goes down. Huh. 
After months of experiencing total agony, seeing this had brought Whitney a sense of peace. Even though her husband had passed away, she takes comfort in the thought that somehow he's still here. As with most videos, feel free to let me know your thoughts on this one. It's definitely touching and... Thanks oh, for watching, man. and I hope you enjoyed. Until next time. I definitely enjoyed, but that last one was definitely sad, so... Um, with that being said, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely the last one was definitely a little upsetting and sad. Um, but let me know what you guys thought of each and every one. Do you guys think they're real, fake, fact, fiction, whatever have you? I love your guys' comments. I read them religiously every day. So keep on doing what you guys are doing. Hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe because it's free to do. It, there's tons to enjoy. And then it, it just gets the channel up there because there's 59% of you guys that are watching my videos but are not subscribed. So make sure you guys consider subscribing and we'll see you guys in the next one. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.